It's been a tough five years for the Director of Public Prosecutions. Alison Saunders insists she was ready to move on. Others claim she wasn't offered a second term. The most recent crisis involved the failure of prosecutors to disclose or share evidence with the defence. Liam Allen was one of at least three young men who had rape allegations against them dismissed at the last moment after new evidence was uncovered. All current rape cases are now being reviewed. Those disclosure issues that occurred were extremely regrettable because they were very late and nobody should have had to go through um, those issues. What we are seeing and what we are looking at is to make sure that we are getting it right as early as we can. Um, I think there are still some significant um, issues. Former Prime Minister Ted Heath faced allegations of historical sexual abuse along with other high-profile figures, including Leon Britton. But Operation Midland resulted in no charges. I said, we're going to go into the house. The family of Lord Janna say making him appear in court when he was in the latter stages of dementia was appalling. His son rejects the idea that all complainants in sex cases should be believed. A stronger DPP would have looked at this, would have looked properly at the evidence, and said, we're not having any of this. Not only in relation to my father, but in relation to Operation Midland. Uh, unfortunately, she was somebody who lacked judgment and lacked leadership. Although Alison Saunders helped to secure the conviction of two men for the murder of Stephen Lawrence, it was to be a rare highlight. Juliet Bremner, ITV News.